Hello everyone, welcome back, welcome back. Finish my uh, hot chocolate, brought my own cup, so don't worry. So it uh, looks like the clubhouse is kind of open. So at least for what I wanted to do. Not 100%, but good enough. All right, enjoy the view out there. Just take a look at that. Really nice, not very humid. Oh wow, nice cool off. I'm sweating a little bit because of the body armor right up against my chest and the uh, camera mount, but uh, if I didn't have that on, I probably wouldn't be sweating at all. All right, all right, let's get going. Let's get going. I'm contemplating whether to go to the secret lake or not, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. I just want to get home. I like my, uh, I like just kind of riding out here at this point because it's, uh, it's a nice destination. It's a nice destination out here. It's a great lake view, or a lake view, I should say. One on the left side, one on the right. I'm contemplating whether to go kayaking, kayaking again out in the Brazos River, but I might not. You know, it's just that uh, it's going to forecast to rain. It's forecasted to rain. Uh, this weekend and next week, so so I don't want to risk it by going out to the to the river and then the the water level is rising. So I'm okay right here. My left hand signal here. Let everybody know I'm turning left. And they are building houses every day. They're not stopping out here. All right. I'm gonna go. Oh, water sprinklers. Sprinklers are working. I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stay away from them because I don't want to get the uh, water mist on the camera lens. It ruins the shot. Putting grass. Oh, they put out. Uh, they put out a sidewalk here. Very nice. All right. Put out sidewalk. Put out grass. It's gonna be nice out here. Nice little neighborhood. I still haven't gone out to the newer neighborhoods yet. I let him finish building it. Man, this place is changing every day. And I'm getting some headwind here. Hopefully when I turn this bend, I'll get a tailwind. Or is it gonna get worse? Not sure. Okay, slightly lightening up. The wind is slightly getting to me. There's a golf cart. I see a lot of these golf carts out here, electric golf carts. They're popular. Good way to get around. Uh, I'm not feeling a tailwind. I'm feeling a side wind. But no tailwind. Yeah, I'm just gonna go home. I just wanted to get my daily, uh, or try to get a daily uh, bike ride out here. Try to get some exercise, work out the legs. There's the high school. No, high school is, uh, they're open. They're they're going. The problem is they're getting COVID cases there. Not sure if the teachers or students. Oh, I got a little bit of tailwind. A little bit of tailwind. 
Oh, it's gone now. Looks like school is over for somebody. Some of these students. My oldest daughter, she goes to high school there. She opted to uh, do online schooling. She didn't want to. Uh, she didn't want to. Uh, she doesn't want to uh, go to school. She likes just waking up in the morning, going through her computer, and voila, she's at school. Feeling good. Feeling good to be outside. Right hand signal. Chest mount camera is dying on me, or a camera is dying. Yeah. Anyways, maybe I'll stop and get the other camera out. I'm pretty sure it's a chest mount. If I'm stopped somewhere, I'll pull it out. Go ahead and pull it out and attach it. Doesn't sound windy, but it's windy out here. Which is okay, fine by me, it works. It works for me. getting a little burn. I'm feeling the burn on my legs here. Have I not been riding the bike that much? That might be true, you know. It's hard to find uh, good days where I can ride my bike. And when I get a chance, I, I try to ride it. The reason my legs are sore is I'm getting low blood flow. I'm having a, a there's a blood clot or a hardened artery in my leg. That's where they put stents. If you have a heart condition or poor circulation, clogged artery, and it's in your leg, they'll put it in your leg. There's stents in your leg. But uh, maybe I'm overreacting. Okay, so red light. Maybe by the time I get there. They'll, uh, I'll be able to stop and change out my chest mount. I'm pretty sure it's my chest mount. Maybe I never started it. It just died on me. It just died on me. That's all it did. It's gonna die on me again. These cameras are getting old. Cameras are getting old. Let me uh, get in the shade here real quick and then let me check on them real, real quick too. I just wanna make sure that they're working. Let's get out of here. Let's go throttle over the stump. Ugh. So I'm a dead stop, not bad. 
bike has enough power to get you going from a dead stop on a throttle up on a slight hill. In the end, I mean, as long as the uh, bike works, that's what counts, right? Now I'm down two bars. People golfing today. It's a beautiful day to golf. squeaking nice brakes are not squeaking let's do the jump we'll do the jump we'll get some more speed here do a jump here all right Ooh, nice nicely done out here slow down don't know what's around the corner here the bushes really obscure your view if you don't remember <laughs> oh there's some people right here yeah got to be careful this is where I broke my hand came right here was going too fast drifted to the right hit up right about here flipped my bike oh man memories Despite the, and I, the front fork bent, oh goodness. And despite that, I still rode the bike home. It was uh, pretty amazing. It's a strong front steel fork, so it's pretty heavy. It's heavy duty as well. again but uh, I'll, I'll just take the road home I want to go home now got my bike right in feels good got a little exercise got a little cardio my legs are feeling the burn what more can I ask for oh yeah and I made a video for you guys yes you for those of you who uh, aren't able to ride during the uh, winter time or you're still waiting for your bikes or you're waiting for your bike to be fixed. Some of you have some bike issues. In either case, welcome, welcome. And, and uh, happy holidays. Happy holidays. Whatever your beliefs are. And, and of course, for all the uh, atheists out there, Enjoy your winter. Enjoy your winter. Is this guy taking the sidewalk out of here? Looks like it. Looks like this guy's taking the sidewalk out of here. same way. I'm taking the same way so it doesn't matter. Oh, 
big truck. Big truck on my left side here. Not gonna go. All right, now I'm gonna go. Uh, use that throttle. Give me a little boost. Not much. After two years of this <laughs> Red Rover, I mean, it's still still going. I'm gonna ride it until it dies, pretty much. There's really no reason for me to get another bike unless there's some dramatic, dramatic improvement or, well, dramatic improvement and a good price reduction. I also noticed there's no uh, holiday special for these uh, electric bikes. I think they're, they just can't keep up demand or they're having manufacturing issues over in China. I don't know if uh, China's ever going to recover, but... Oh! Something just hit me on my shoulder. It's a leaf. Sometimes it's a bug. It scares me. It freaks me out. Alright. So... I don't know. I got, I got three electric bikes. All the parts are relatively compatible with each other. So bikes, uh, the, the batteries are definitely compatible. Uh, parts, easy to get. At least the uh, maintenance parts. Brake pads, calipers, you know, whatever, the levers, the wires. So uh, I think I'm good. So if they, whatever reason, the world ended tomorrow. I think I got a couple more years out of uh, at least one of these bikes. I got three three electric bikes. I think I can get a couple of years out of them before they uh, before they die out on me. So if you think about the cost savings, that's huge. The more you ride it, the longer you ride it. Don't put any more money into it. Just ride it. You're gonna you're gonna get your money back and then some. There's a sheriff on the left. He's got a special car. You can't see the, uh, you can't see where it says sheriff. It's like blended white. It's white on white. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh gosh, a little dusty out here. Yeah, this is what I like. Riding in the in a chill of an afternoon at 70 degrees. Perfect. Handlebars, or the grips feel good. My hands are not numb. You know, they feel good. Getting good circulation in them. I'm getting good grip. They're smaller. They feel smaller, more tacky, more grippy. Riding their bikes, walking around. They should. Guy on a motorcycle. Can't get any better than this. Oh, heavy wind here. I'm uh, feeling heavy wind. Another reason why I wear the buff is, uh, you know, you get this wind. Is this guy riding an electric bike or a motorcycle on the sidewalk? Anyways. Another reason why I... Oh, this, that's the red uh, wagon guy. Hey, <laughs> good to see you, man. That's the red wagon guy, man. <laughs> He's riding his bike, too. Oh, this car, this Porsche. It comes up really close. All right, this is where I go off-roading. Okay. Uh. All right, let me lower gear. Come out here. Ugh. He probably went up to Valero to get his favorite beer. He says he likes going up to the Valero, which is up the street there, and uh, close to the state highway, local highway. And uh, he says that's where he likes to get his favorite beer. Ugh. 
Uh, okay, I'll throttle here. Actually, I put, put it down in the lower gear because I'm gonna. I'm just gonna throttle. I want to get close to home. I'm gonna start pedaling it in. Oh yeah, Cramp Buster. Cramp Buster is awesome for this. Love the Cramp Buster. Oh, something turned off. Something turned off. What turned off? Gosh. I hear a camera noise. Let me, let me just stop real quick and just see what it is. Is it the front camera again? Anyways, what I think, what was I saying? Yeah, the puff. Uh, you get, with the colder weather and the little dust, you get a lot of, you might get a runny nose. Like I'm, I'm kind of getting a runny nose right now. And uh, with the buff, it's, it stops it right at your nose. You can put the buff right up on, your, up on your nose and it'll stop the runny nose right there. So it doesn't go in your mouth. The best thing you want is a bunch of snot in your mouth while you're uh, riding your bike. Anyways, please like, share, comment. Let me know what, uh, what you all do here. Or how you're enjoying your winter riding. Bye, bye. Bye, everybody. Oh. Oh. All right, coming in hot, 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 hot. All right, ooh, docking the bike. Dock, dock the bike, and crunk, 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 crunk. throttle, crunk. Okay, <laughs> got it. Oh. That was fun, that was, that was fun. All right, everyone. Please like, share, subscribe. Bye.